Hello and welcome. You're watching the news. I'm Kavita Krishnan. Our top story this hour, a 10th standard student was found dead in a leading Kolkata school. The body of the girl was recovered from the washroom of the school in a pool of blood. The student was declared dead on arrival at the hospital. Police are investigating the matter. That's the big story we are getting for you right now. A, a, a girl was found dead in a pool of blood. She is studying in the 10th standard of a reputed Kolkata school. I am joined by my colleague uh, Tamal with more on this. Uh, Tamal, uh, what can you tell us about this case? Uh, what progress have the police really made uh, as far as uh, this, uh, this case is concerned? Well, two things. This incident happened yesterday at a very reputed school in South Kolkata. And uh, the girl was found inside the washroom locked uh, with her left uh, wrist uh, slit. And uh, there was also plastic on top of her head, a plastic bag that was covering her head. Now, these are the two clues which uh, police have found so far. And uh, it seems to be indicative of uh, a suicide. Why? Because there was also a suicide note found along with the body. Now, the, the class team student, who has also been a topper in the school, apparently in the suicide note has mentioned that there had been extreme pressure of studies on her. And the reason why she has taken this extreme step. But then police are not really taking anything on the face value as yet. They are proving everything, every aspect. Uh, whether there is any foul play or not, something they are also proving. Uh, they have tried going through all the CCTV camera visuals inside the school. We have to recall this is the same school in South Kolkata which has rose to spotlight, uh, which had risen to spotlight last year when there was an incident of alleged molestation inside the school premises, uh, which had triggered a massive protest uh, by students and the families of the students. Uh, uh, thereafter, several preventive measures had been taken, and one of them was CCTV cameras being installed in corridor and, of course, uh, close to the washroom just to ensure that people going inside or students going inside the washroom, their movements are, can also be tracked, that nobody should be following them there. So the student who is a class 10 student who had been a topper was in the middle of a class session when she had taken permission from the teacher to go to the washroom. But after having taken too long to come back, uh, uh, that had stoked suspicion and the teacher had then followed uh, uh, her to the washroom but then had found the washroom door to be locked from inside. Uh, teachers had actually made the effort of uh, climbing from the other side to ensure the lock be opened. And only when the lock, we, uh, lock was open, they found... Uh, um, the, the girl uh, inside the washroom in a pool of blood with a plastic bag on top of her head uh, right. with her left wrist slit and there was also a, pa a paper which eventually turned out to be an, a, a perpetrated suicide note. Uh, the girl was immediately rushed to the hospital but uh, doctors suggest that uh, right. she had passed away. Tamal, the way. Tamal, the other thing that I want to ask you is if, uh, if we go by the purported suicide note where the girl is allegedly saying that you know she was under a lot of pressure uh, because of her uh, because of the fact that she was in the class 10 that she was a topper uh, what does uh, what does the school management uh, the parents etc have to say is anybody did this girl at any point in time ask or seek help nothing of that sort ha uh, ha has come to light uh, the family is extremely distraught now they have not issued any press statement so far but the school uh, school authorities have got nothing against the child to say. In fact, she had been a school topper. She had been a class topper. And uh, she had been extremely good in her academics. So this, this incident has been equally a shocker for the school authorities. The school authorities have not really said anything that can give any new possibility to probe for police. But at this point in time, police are going through the CCTV cameras, uh, they are also speaking to other friends of the child and right. they are also speaking with the school authorities. At this point in time, it's a very initial, it's at a very initial stage of investigation. Uh, the school authorities have requested everyone to ensure that uh, there is nothing untoward as a follow-up of this incident, that police do their job and uh, that no one should jump into any kind of conclusion uh, affecting education of uh, the other students. Right. At this point in time, uh, police people are probing the matter. We have to wait for, for the clarity. Right, Tamal. Thank you for getting us all of those details. And that's the story that we're getting for you right now. Uh, 
a 10th standard student, a school topper in fact like my colleague uh, Tamal just told us, uh, in a reputed South Kolkata school found in a pool of blood in the school washroom. The washroom door was locked from inside. Uh, she was also found with an alleged suicide note.